Throughout this pandemic, rule makers have become rule breakers. This time it was Nicola Sturgeon. Scotland's First Minister pictured standing in a bar at a funeral wake without a face mask. She broke her own rules and today, mask back on, she offered the Scottish Parliament a robust apology. I want to take this opportunity to say how sorry I am for my breach of rules that I ask all of us to follow every single day. I want to be clear today that regardless of the circumstances I was in the wrong, there are no excuses. These rules do apply to me, just as they do to everyone else, and the rules really matter. Nicola Sturgeon's apology is the latest, but not the first. I did not follow the advice I'm giving to others. I'm truly sorry for that. Her own chief medical officer quit after visiting her holiday home during lockdown. Meanwhile, Margaret Ferrier MP still refuses to resign after travelling from Scotland to London and back again while she had coronavirus. Nicola Sturgeon's transgression at the stable bar here in Edinburgh is minor in comparison, but it raises questions about how realistic her rules are. She was socially distanced, but she was standing up in a bar with no face mask on, clearly breaking her own rules. Interestingly, by the letter of Nicola Sturgeon's own law, if she had taken a seat to speak to the people, she would have been absolutely fine. We showed this picture of the rule-breaking First Minister to people in Edinburgh today. It's one rule for one, you know, one rule for everybody else. We should wear a mask whether we are standing or sitting now. Mm -hmm. I do feel for her because I think we've all forgotten to put masks on. Not a single opposition leader challenged Nicola Sturgeon about this today. Her apology seems to have worked. But rival politicians are also aware it could be their party next. Peter Smith, ITV News, Edinburgh.